Okay, we're going to install Slender 0.9.7, so the first thing we need to do is head to playonlinux.com and download a copy for your distribution. I'm using Ubuntu 1204 LTS, and I've already downloaded the Debian package, so I'm going to go ahead and install that. Now we can close out and we need to grab a copy of Slender from parsecproductions.net forward slash Slender. Let's grab the Windows copy and you want to download 0.97. I already have a copy of that on the desktop. So let's go ahead and extract this folder to the desktop. And we can close out and we need to launch Play on Linux. You can choose to send data or not. Now we'll have to go through our Play on Linux first use. Let's click Next. And we'll be prompted to install some Microsoft fonts. Let's click Agree. Now we're done with that. Click Next and enjoy using Play on Linux. Now from here we need to add a wine version. So we will select 1.42 raw 3. That's with the raw input patch. Another wizard. Click Next. Now the installation is complete, we can close out this screen and we need to go to configure and we're going to add a new virtual drive. Let's click next and you want to select 14RC4 RAW 3 and we'll call it Slender. Let's try to spell that correctly. Better. Now we have our um, Slender directory, so what we want to do is copy this to our Play on Linux home. So let's select Copy. We'll open up our home folder and visit Play on Linux. You might not see this by default, so make sure you have Show Hidden Files selected. We'll enter here, Wine Prefix, Slender, Drive C, Program Files, and Paste. Now we'll close this and select Make a New Shortcut from this virtual drive. Here's Slender. Click Next. Name it what you will. I'm going to call it Slender. Cancel. We have that together, so we can close that. And you can see it's created a launcher on the desktop and also from Play on Linux. If we press Run, we should have the options there. Start the game and make sure the mouse input works. Well then, enjoy.